Hey y'all, how's it going? It's Wyatt here today. I'm here to bring you another chess video. Um, I have gone from 199 ELIM about a week and a half ago to being at 463. I just wanted to tell people uh, the steps I've kind of took to get better and um, yeah, we'll just go about it from there. So when I started playing, uh, I was at about 200. Elo, I didn't have any understanding of chess from what a column was to uh, what it uh, in inaccuracy was. I played a little bit in high school with some friends, but I never learned the principles or fundamentals of the game. For about like two, three weeks now, I've been studying it as well as playing it a whole lot. But uh, I've noticed for me in general, I think playing is the thing that helps. Watching the videos it helps me get some of the moves because uh, one of the things that I didn't realize is how some of the other, op how your other opponent's pawns, usually closest to um, the king on like the left or the right side, are very, very susceptible when you have like a bishop hitting that pawn and then another uh, piece attacking it. Um, I didn't really understand those moves. I played the game as if like you were trying to take more points from the opponent. I didn't think about it as protect your king at all times, even though that's a game of chess. When you're a beginner, you don't really see those um, more advanced moves, I would say. But in playing this wonderful game that we are all in together and we all love, I've learned a few things. Um, one, stick to, uh, I mean, maybe I'm just saying this wrong, but I stick to the openings that I like and I know. The openings that I get a higher win rate. I do London on white, and then on, um, I think it's like piano or P uh, something, but it's just a basic like um, bishop, knight, the pawn right in front of your king's pawn, you bring up one space so you can get out your other bishop. That's what I do for black. And I just follow those every single time. I feel like that helps me with my start. Uh, I noticed in the three to five hundred level uh, people are taking a long time with their first couple moves and um and i've played about three four hundred games and i know that's a lot for like only 400 and not not the greatest but one day i'm gonna be the best uh anyway i see people take so long in their beginnings and when you know you're beginning like a london uh of course you know when you can't just stick by your original baseline plan and when you have to switch it up but uh it just helps you Helps you have the current, the, the motions, and you don't have to think really. And I feel like the later and farther you get into the game, that's when you really need to be focusing on that. Beginning of the game, just get your start and get it right. If you can get an extra pawn, oh my god, you're set. If you can get like a knight, it hurts so bad off the start of the game to lose a knight or a bishop. But honestly, how much does it mean when you're a beginner? How many, I mean, you just don't use all of your pieces at the same time, so. Guys, I think this is all for today. Rui wants the utmost attention and love. Get that booty out of here, boy. Yeah. You guys have a great one. I really appreciate you watching this video. If you made it to the end, hit that like and the subscribe button. I'd love to see you in the next one. Take it easy, guys.